A South Plains family asking for your help tonight after their brand new trailer was stolen right from their driveway. Our Emily Harrison met up with the family to check in on them. Now, Emily, the family had some big plans for this trailer, too. They did, John. It was actually supposed to be a food truck for the family with a brand new business. It happened early Monday morning when a pickup truck came to a quiet neighborhood and stole it right out of their driveway. What they didn't realize, though, is that there was surveillance footage right in their neighbor's house that caught the whole thing happening. So now the police have that footage and are actively trying to find both the trailer and the suspect, but it leaves the family with a lot of questions. Shabria Martin couldn't believe her eyes when she found her driveway empty with her brand new trailer gone. And I called my mom. I was like, Mom, you got the trailer? She was like, no. She was like, I don't know where it's at. And I was thinking, well, maybe she used it uh, helping one of our brothers or something. But then when she said no, I panicked. The trailer was going to fulfill a childhood dream, a gift to her husband to further his catering business by putting it on wheels. If they wanted it or even wanted to try to buy it, you know, they should have been more respectful to come and knock on the door and say, oh, are y'all selling this trailer? How much do y'all want for it? Instead of just coming up and just taking it when it was supposed to be used for something, someone's dream. Something that someone always wanted since he was little. Shabria ran to the next door neighbor's house asking for help, only to realize that the whole thing was caught on tape. So they end up recording everything that happened, how the truck pulled in, took the trailer and stuff, and I was just like, the only thing that bothered me about it was that they were that bold to do it in broad daylight. Although relieved that the whole incident was caught on camera, Shabria says the whole experience has left her uneasy. When we moved to this neighborhood, it's a cul-de-sac, you know, no traffic comes in and out. And, you know, I was thinking like, oh, well, this is a good neighborhood, nothing to happen. But I guess you can't really judge a neighborhood because look what happened to us. Now, police, again, are still looking for both the trailer and the suspect. If you have any information, you're encouraged to go to the police or check out more information on our website at everythinglubbock.com, where you can find that link to check in with the police. All right. Thanks, Emily.